Hi there, it is Baz at gotaukulele.com with another instrument review. I've been really quite excited about doing this one for you. Um, this is a bit of an ambition of mine to have one of these on the website. Uh, this is a resonator tenor ukulele made by Beltona in the UK, uh, in Yorkshire. It's the Songster Type 2 tenor, Type 2 signifying the shape up here, which we'll come on to, but it really is a rather lovely lovely thing um, resonators basically a, uh, a hollow body uh, mounted with a cone uh, on top of which sits a bridge which uh, takes the vibrations from the strings down and amplifies them out it's basically a non-electric speaker if you see what I mean um, most resonators are either made from wood or are made from brass, uh, bell brass bodies. This is made uh, by Steve Evans at Beltona and it is made from fiberglass, um, which is his thing. Uh, and it means it's very light, uh, but also very strong. And he says claims has the same sound to a metal body. Um, as you see, uh, bottom half, traditional tenor shape. Top half got this fantastic curved cup cutaway and an opposite shoulder here which I think, I think that looks really really nice um, they do do this in a standard double bout shape as well if you prefer but you know when they look this good um, and the whole body is finished in a glossy what they call an automotive finish it is shiny kind of um, slightly metallic blue uh, painted all over as you can see with the back we've got a bit of arching going on and this nice sort of ridge down the back which i think is really nice and there we are um resonator cone sits inside these are hand spun aluminium cones made directly for beltona um and then sitting on top of that is a biscuit style bridge which you can see in there of which the strings run which gives you the uh, the projection we've got a fiberglass automotive finish uh, grill top there looks like a colander um, and that is that uh, rosewood saddle piece uh, bridge ending to mount the strings into basically ignore the strap pin I had that fitted by the shop um, moving on up we have a one piece mahogany neck which is finished in gloss it's absolutely gorgeous i don't normally like gloss on necks but it's not sticky at all um, on top of that rosewood fingerboard really nicely even in color we've got position markers in purloid dots including a double here sadly no position markers on the sides but it is absolutely gorgeous the frets are finished impeccably well it's just so comfortable to hold um, nut appears to be made of rosewood or ebony which is nice and just look at the headstock um, I like individual looking headstocks and that is an individual looking headstock sorry you're losing the logo there because of the bright light uh, which is a shame that is better um, it's got this asymmetric curve on the top uh, and as you'll have seen it is fitted with friction tuners don't worry about that I think they look great they're good quality friction tuners with metal collars and washers they move like butter they hold tuning perfectly what's not to like um, it just gives that headstock a minimal sort of vintage look to it it kind of goes with this more modern styling at the top I, th I just think it's a really pretty thing have a read of the full review you'll see that I gush about this one because it is pretty special price wise these come in at about 800 pounds you may be thinking my word that is expensive for a resonator I'm not entirely sure it is expensive national resonators which I don't like as much as these um, run to serious amounts more than that yeah you can get cheap resonators for two or three hundred quid but in my experience they're pretty ropey, echoey in sound. Um, whether you like a resonator or not, I mean, this is not going to give you sort of a solid wood, pure colour tone, anything like that. They sound what they like, what they are. Um, they're kind of like they give you that bit of extra punch, but without the sort of melt your face off punch that a banjo gives you, uh, and a bit more sustain, a bit more beauty to it. Uh, Old timey, great for blues, great for anything really. Um, 
a really nice sound. The problem with cheaper resonators I find is that the cones and the metal work tend to rattle and give it a very echoey tone. You always get a bit of that with a resonator but this one's just got a much purer tone. Playability and setup is absolutely impeccable. Um, there's absolutely nothing wrong with it. I mean it just plays so fast and so comfortable. Um, have a listen. Um, strummed, it sounds great. Uh, picked, it's very clear and lovely. Um, If you like resonator tones, I think this is one of the best I've played. Um, I've been wanting one of these for a long time. Uh, it's just seriously good, handmade in Yorkshire, in the UK. Used to be made in New Zealand, but um, back in the UK again now. Um, I just love absolutely everything about it. Um, I can noodle with this forever. Uh, volume, I mean, it's hard to tell. I've got a microphone on here, but it's louder than a lot of acoustic ukuleles. Not as loud as a banjo. That is a good thing. Um, Beltona, Songster, Tenor, uh, ukulele, Resonator, made in fiberglass, made in the UK. Highly recommended. Please do read the written review for more details about it. And keep an eye on godaukulele.com for more instrument reviews coming very soon.